Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today we've got Happy Birthday Terry at Miss Terry's Nails. This is an Instagram collaboration hosted by Tinkerbell 1970s and painted by Pinky. Our theme was makeup and nail polish. And I get to use this cute kawaii emoji plate from Maniology and it is um, perfect for this. I'll be using Bases Loaded Lacquer on the Black and this is BMXL325 and I'm going to pull up different images for this hair manicure and we're going to fill them in and make them colorful and pretty. And I'm really excited about this one. I was really excited because I bought this plate a little while back and I've been wanting to use it but I didn't really have a good excuse for it. Does that make any sense? I know we don't really need excuses but I knew that a collab would come along like this and I would need this one so I was holding out. So I'm just pulling up different images. Oh, I dropped the stamper and look at that. I still managed to pick it up. Excellent. Yay, yay. So I'm getting the little scissors and a little stamper and I've got the lipsticks and the bottles of nail polish and we're just going to town. We're just getting all of these. And I did use a bunch of different stampers, you know, some Maniology Cube stampers, some, uh, these are the Conad stampers. I am going to clean this plate off with pure acetone. Flip my cotton ball over. And then I'm going to rub my paper towel across it. This was before I figured out, you know, the lint-free wipes, so it, it'll be a minute. I'm cleaning off that stamping plate, too. I like everything clean. A little OCD about it. My little mat all clean. I'll be using floss gloss polishes and this is Malibu Job and the next one is called Wet and then we have ooh wee Fast Lane and then this one is El Capitan and then the last one here is International Hot Girl and these are going to be used to fill in. I'm going to use this Maniology Detail Brush. And I'm just going to, you know, go in and color these in. And hope that I'm not too shaky today and I can do these pretty good. I actually know the end result already because I'm doing a voiceover and I know I did okay on these. Not perfect. Mine are never perfect. But pretty good. Pretty good. Not too crazy. I didn't get too crazy out of the lines. And this little brush is a nice one. It does have a very tiny tip on it. And as long as I don't load too much polish on there or get shaky, we're good. So I'm going to fill in one color at a time. I'm not going to, I'm, I'm going to give this one time to dry before I go in with the next color. So I'm going to go through all my stampers and I'm going to try to use as many of the polishes on each stamped image to keep it cohesive, keep everything looking like it belongs together. And I'm telling you what, these little um, polish bottles with the little faces on it are killing me. And look at the little lipsticks. Got the little faces. This is too stinking cute. I am in love with this. And I know you're not going to wear something like this every day, but for funsies, yeah. And look at the little scissors. Oh my goodness. Adorable. Adorable. I'm telling you. Now I'm getting out of the lines on this a little bit, but you know what? It's all right. It's okay. It really is. Because, you know, typically people don't get down on your nails and look that close. I mean, unless you're nail junkies like us, you know, it might happen. But for the most part, like people in real life don't get up on my nails that close. So we're all good on that. And it, it'll be okay even if they did notice with, you know. I don't know that I've ever been called out like in real life about, oh, you were, oh, that's messy and mm -mm, never happened. Everybody always loves your nails. They love them. And the, I mean, that's just too cute with them little bottles. Oh my goodness. So while this is happening, this filling in of the, you know, images. I'm going to just chat a little bit. Um, we're going to, um, we're all pulling together for Miss Terry's birthday. 
And I do hope that y'all will go over to Instagram and check out Miss Terry's, in, Terry's Instagram channel, as well as all the manicures that were done in this collaboration for her birthday. Oh, I just pulled that little heart up. It'll be okay, though. Because didn't everybody know there's supposed to have three of them in there in, on that side anyway? Um, I will have links down in the description box for all of the participants, as well as a hashtag if you want to. I find it easy when you can just click on that hashtag, and you go to the hashtag page, and you can see all the manicures in one spot instead of clicking on each person individually. Um, that's just my take on it. So, hopefully, I will have a hashtag listed for you down below, and that you guys will go check them all out. Um, you guys know that my heart here is on YouTube, and um, there was no stipulation that to be in this collab, you needed to do it on Instagram and YouTube. I just feel the need to share it all. If I'm doing it, I'm sharing it, you know? And I'm more comfortable over here on YouTube. I don't know really why that is, but it's, it's the way I feel. Um, Instagram's just a little, I, you know, first of all, I do it on my phone, so it's really hard to type in all those big messages and all that goodness. Um, I'm just, I do better here on my laptop editing videos on my computer. I guess that's, that's the bottoms of it all. I love these. These are just so cute. I'm loving these images. Cute, cute. All right, we're getting closer, y'all. And I know that these videos are longer when I do videos like this. But so many of y'all have told me, you don't care how long they are. So, um, we'll have some long ones, some short ones, some medium ones. We'll just, you know, keep doing what we do. <coughs> Excuse me. Y'all know it's springtime, so there's going to be a lot of clearing of the throats and nasally sounding videos coming from me for the next probably month or two. Um, everything is blooming and changing outside. Our cars are covered in that yellowy green dust. Lovely. Um, got way out of line on that one. Okay, sorry about my phone buzzing on the desk while we were doing this, but, you know, stuff happens, y'all. <laughs> it's okay. At least it wasn't ringing or it wasn't the weather alert box screaming at me. All right, so we're going to keep on moving on, moving on. We're almost done. I know I keep saying it, but it's true. We're almost there. We're getting there. And I just, I really enjoyed this theme. Um, like I said, I've been looking forward to using this stamping plate. Well, as soon as it came in, I wanted to use it, but I knew something like this was going to hop up real soon, and it did. Yay! So we got even more reasons to celebrate other than Miss Terry's birthday, too. All right, so on my nails, I've got on Nail Teaks Formula 2, and I'm going to be using Moonshine Manny Kiss Me. And this is from her Project Dupe It. I don't really know what this was a dupe for. I just feel the desire and need to own all of her Dupe It polishes. I know, it's a sickness. I mean, I might even have whatever she duped this off of, but I got to have it. And here we go with another coat of Kiss Me. And, you know, it's it's okay to have, because Phoebe's dupes aren't dead-on dupes, okay? They're, uh, they're very, very close. And, um, yeah, I love them. I love, I've loved all of them so far. So we're topping this with the I&Ms out the door. I've got to get this polished to dry down so we can put those decals on. Look how pretty. Got that sparkle on it. I'll be using the Maniology Sticky Base Coat today. And I'm going to apply that to the nail in a thin coat. You can kind of see how thin I'm doing it. You can see the brush strokiness. I've already applied one. My camera must have been acting janky. And so now here we go with the little lipsticks. Oh, and I had a piece not go. Ta-da! Good save. Good save. All right. And I did put that sticky base coat on all the nails. I just showed me doing one. And look how bright and pretty this little manicure is. Now to get this stamper on my pinky nail. I thought it was going to fit so well. But look, it's it's a little big on there. <laughs> oh, goodness. 
All right, so anything that I didn't stamp onto my nails, I clean my stampers off on a lint roller just like I normally would. And I am using my other little scissors, my little curvy scissors, to trim off some of this excess. So I don't have to melt and clean up that much of it. The more I can trim up and get off, the better it'll be when I go to do the acetone. I, don't, I guess those are just like manicure scissors or something. I don't know what they're called, really. Um, they're kind of curvy on the end, and I normally use my nippy scissors. But we're going in with the acetone, and I'm melting off what I don't want. You know, that stuff that's hanging over the edge. And I dip in the acetone, and normally I dip it on the paper towel. I didn't do it that time, but normally I go into the little acetone, dip it on the paper. Oh, I was real quick with that one. And then go at it. And I do try to wipe that brush off real well before re-dipping into the acetone. Just to keep it from getting all muddied. And these are cleaning up really well. Uh, I have no complaints. There we go. I'm going to dial you in a little bit so you can see my cleanup process just maybe a little bit better. Let's see if I can stay in frame. You guys know I'm bad about it. So there we go. Getting all up around that edge and across the end or the tip of my nail. I always have to go underneath. And no, I didn't paint my thumb. It didn't make it into the picture, so I didn't bother. Um, <laughs> sorry. I am going to top these with the smudge free top coat from Maniology. So I can top them without smearing them. And then. Then I'll put my glossy top coat on. And here we go. And today we'll be using Posh Top Coat. Get that glossiness and get it to dry down between the layers. And I really, really loved this one. And I hope you guys enjoyed it too. I do hope you'll go check out all the other manicures over on Instagram. Here is my swatch photo. Let me a comment. Let me know what you think about it. I want to thank you for watching. Until next time. Be good to yourself.